hitting hard hitting line of storms yeah. rolled right through uh, around six o'clock here in the Omaha Metro and uh, it took a while to get going, but once it did, woo, packed a punch. Those storms fired up in uh, western South Dakota and as they made their way into Nebraska early this morning, you see intensifying Boeing out and then right through Omaha just sweeping through. Now those storms all the way out in Chicago right now, but it left a path of destruction. Uh, all these little dots here, high wind reports or wind damage stretching uh, from north of Norfolk down through Hooper, uh, Fremont around the Omaha Metro as we took uh, a direct hit with many spots seeing those gusts 60 to 70 miles per hour. We've had gusts uh, upwards of 80 miles miles per hour. Ewing, Nebraska and Northeast Dodge County. Howells, Nebraska, just shy of 80 miles per hour. Corning, Iowa, 70 miles per hour. Fremont, 63. So most of uh, the metro area, 60 to 70 miles per hour, knocking down those tree limbs and causing uh, those thousands and thousands of power outages. Super Doppler 7 Redder right now, much more quiet. Even after the main line, we still had some uh, uh, quick little downpour, some rumbles of thunder, but Nice to see the blue sky now. That's I-80 and Giles. Currently 75, so temperatures are rebounding after we spent most of the morning in the 60s after that line moved through. Dew points, though, still mid to upper 60s, so there's still a lot of moisture in the air. Still going to be a bit humid as we head through the afternoon with temperatures rebounding. Many spots low to mid 70s. Currently dew points 60s to around 70s, so you'll get to feel that heat uh, a little bit more, even though temperatures likely only making it into the mid 80s by the end of the afternoon. Now, more likely we'll see storms redevelop late this afternoon into the evening closer to Kansas City, uh, but still maybe as north as uh, some of our counties uh, down in northwest Missouri, Maryville area, but I think a little better chance uh, the more south you go into Kansas and Missouri overnight. We're quiet, may see a bit of patchy fog to start the day tomorrow. Temperatures fairly warm and then tomorrow uh, warming up into the mid and upper 80s. There is a small chance we get a pop up shower storm in the afternoon. Better chances will be off to our west, but I think we'll see a little better chance for more rain and storms. Not looking severe right now, but uh, Thursday night and into Friday. The weekend looking mainly dry, but we'll keep those temperatures fairly warm in the mid to upper 80s continuing into next week.